Hi, I'm the Calculus Professor, and today we'll be talking about antiderivatives. In problem number 61, we'd like to find the antiderivative capital F of little f of v equals secant v times tangent of v that satisfies that capital F of 0 equals 2. So we have an initial value problem where we want the antiderivative at 0 to be equal to 2. So what we really want to do is we want to find all antiderivatives of this guy and then figure out which of those satisfies my initial condition. Okay, so first thing we want to do is let's take the antiderivative of secant v tangent v. So what we want is the indefinite integral of secant of v times tangent of v dv. Fortunately, that's relatively easy. We know what the antiderivative of secant v tangent v is. It is secant of v plus a constant, right? So uh, this is all of my antiderivatives, and I want to know if v were equal to 0, then what would c have to be in order for f of 0 to be equal to 2? In other words, I want to set this thing equal to 2 and plug in that v is 0. So 2 should be secant of 0 plus c. And now we can solve for c. Well, first of all, what is secant of 0? Well, secant is 1 over cosine. And so I guess I could ask, what's cosine of 0? Cosine of 0 is 1. So secant of 0 is also 1. So we get that 2 is equal to uh, 1 plus c. And then just solving for c, we have that c is equal to 1. Okay. Now that I know what c is, I can write the particular antiderivative that I'm looking for because I know that it's going to be equal to this guy, except now I know what c is. c is 1. So what I get is that f, capital F, of v, the one I'm looking for, is secant of v plus the particular c that gets the job done for me. So c, we figured out, was 1, so plus 1. And that's the particular antiderivative that we're looking for.